When we met her last year right here on our stage, she was not in the least shy about a romantic relationship with incarcerated world boss Vibes Cartel. But as I said, may I leave that that is very deep mm -hmm. and there's not a lot of people gonna understand it. She's now in Jamaica and we are just minutes away from meeting Lisa Mercedes in the flesh for an exclusive one-on-one. -on -one. Nice Gage's output never ceases. Like but why does his profile appear rather low? The truth earth and the truth is it gone already. The dancehall Gage will be here to engage us. Road, yeah, well done, In place of our usual Who is segment this week, we are asking this question. Why the artist known as Deruption no boss yet. Same question about the artist known as Candy Price. Those questions are as much for you, the fans of Dancehall, us in media, as they are for the two artists. Both, by the way, will be right here on our stage. Plus, Guinness's top 10 trending, top stories, and more. Welcome to the show, everyone. I am Winford Williams. We'll be right back. On stage with Winford Williams. Now, Guinness Top 10 Trending for this week. Rate to rate you by Squash starts off our countdown at number 10. Roaring into the number 9 spot, Queen of Mabay Tollop with Waistline. For 50 with his breakthrough song Imperfection is this week's number 8 trending track. While Franco Wildlife is hurt at number 7. At number 6 this week, trending Prince Intense with what seems to be his summer anthem, Turn Off. And starting off our top 5, it's Cash Promise Move featuring Jada Kingdom with Ride Remix. Ragging King is holding strong on our countdown and is this week number 4 with Plead My Cause. Coming in at number 3, Nation Boss and Yaxta, Emotions. And at number two, Ritical with Chosen. Soaring to the number one spot on our trending countdown this week, it's a man who is no stranger to trending, Governor. And this one is called Karen. Beg what? No, me not beg friend. What is that? Beg friend. No, you not like me, but I'm me first. Yeah. Me not run in, no, a dog that make me knee hurt. All right, so there you have it. Guinness Top 10 Trending Songs in Jamaica for this week. Stay with us right here on our stage. Lisa Mercedes graces our stage in the flesh. Gage gets off his chest critical thoughts about dancehall unity. Has Candy Price found her moment in dancehall? And why the eruption? No boss yet. All coming up right here on our stage. We'll be back. On Stage is brought to you in part by Golden Crust Caribbean Restaurant. Savor the flavor of Jamaica for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Visit goldencrust.com to order for pickup or delivery now. And by Atlanta Rum and Wine Festival. For tickets and info, visit atlantarumandwinefestival.com. Candy Price is one of the artists we are asking, 
Why them no boss yet? Tell them it's the right time, it's the right time. And it's not for a lack of exposure. For as a former Magnum Kings and Queens of Dancehall contestant, she had gotten plenty of exposure. Then in 2019, a viral video of her freestyling in her community. Money, I'm a mind. Now is the time. Me, I come from far and they must stay behind. Tell them shoot for the star, they must look chafe for climb. Got the endorsement of no other than Vibes Cartel, the world boss. So why then is Candy not a big artist out there? That's a question we have right now for her because she's right here on our stage. Candy, welcome. Hi, Mr. Winfrey. Uh, mad, mad, mad love. Must say, mad love. I must say, before we start the interview, mm -hmm. you know how much time imagine myself I talk to you. Oh. Like, now you really imagine I practice, stand up in front of my mother, dressed oh. and just I practice to talk to you. Oh. Um, is that why you're so comfortable? Yeah. Nice. Good to know. <laughs> All right, then. So, answer that question for us. Oh, the question now, I'm basically. Being a female in a male-dominated industry, you know, that definitely hard. Fit, fit, fit. And without, like, the resources mm -hmm. that come on, like, job top now, we have a, who is a producer, we yes. know, we have invest in your career. A man just now go just give a rhythm just like that. Even if him do give the rhythm, he now go put no effort in a your song or effort in a you unless him interested. Yes. In a yo. And female normally, I forgot to it more harder because either you have to sleep with that producer, forget it, or maybe I forgot to do something else. But then it did worse to me though, but mm -hmm. no, it can't So you had a better. lot of that? that? No, no, never had, never had a producer um, approach to you like, like that. that. Yes. God bless, you know? Oh, yeah, yeah, good yeah. for you. Never had one of that. But it, the journey is rough, man, really, really rough. Cause yeah, yeah, when I reach all the stage show you now and the big artists, them, they, they, you know, I fight to get all of my spot. Yes. You know what I mean? So it, 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 you have to prove yourself. Like you have to, that's why, to me, I kind of step out of the normal female box. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and put myself in a different category. So are you getting some love now? More than some love. More than love, I go on now. <laughs> yeah, this yeah, yeah. is your moment. Right now. And what makes you say that? Yeah, because um, you're seeing different light now. I um, have a producer now and a good management team. I'm dropped up records, you know. Yes. We're endorsing clocks. So, you know, it, all of that coming up and you get, due to the corona, you know, not to get a show and all, but all of that in play. We're releasing songs now. And we're songs about buzz? Yeah, we're buzz. playing You're getting radio. some buzz out there? Yeah, 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 yeah you yourself are playing at cars now. So, it, and then I like how you say, yo, play my song. You know what I mean? So you can not see the work are coming now. You can not see the growth. Clarks, talk about the Clarks. Yeah, the Clarks and that's me now, you know. Um, one of the best moments for me, mm -hmm. like here, so now. Because um, just by being um, an ambassador for Clarks, like, people see a different. Yes. Yeah, people respect it more. Yeah. Of course they would. I mean, that, yeah. and so is, your, is there a sense of fashion? That, yeah, it's that a, that definitely deal? a sense of fashion for me. I'm more tomboy, yes. girl boy, kind of like something. But, you know, we like being comfortable. The deal is with Clarks, the, the, the parent company, the parent brand? No, it's with Job Top Swag Shop. That's, that's, a, that's my producer, but he has a Clark store in Jamaica. Yes. So I mother clerks for him. Oh, I see what you mean. And where is it located? It's shop 22, Central Plaza. Central Plaza? Alpha Tree. In Alpha Tree? Yeah. Yeah. So how did they get on to you? Job Top um, is the owner of the clerk store. Um, I, he posted my song, my, my freestyle, as I said earlier on, and Cartel commented and said, my, my daughter is sent her to me. And, mm -hmm. you know, we went viral and Job Top searching me and find me. And it was like, after that, it was like, all right, I'm going to buy say no one. I'm going to make it do an album. And after that, it was like, blessing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. OK, so, and the deal is working out for you? Definitely working out. Working out not only right in terms of money. <laughs> yeah, not only but, in terms of money, but... But more respect. More and, respect. I, yeah. I don't ask for that to really be a, a two-week or a three-month mm. artist. Yes. I want to be an everlasting artist. So even my great-grandkids can listen to my music. Yeah. So you know, like when the dancer play and 
you hear them old songs, they were half a play to make your sound sound like a sound. Yes. Them songs, they may talk about. <laughs> yeah. All right, I like that. Let's just go back here and get, get you out of your, your video. Oh, many lonely nights, tears I've cried. See, if it's time, I want to change my life. This really nice, really nice. Choose your choice, you better do or die. This world got a hold on me. Fake love, bad energy. Best friends turn enemies. Why you want to see the end of me? Take a hold of your life, make it right. And you have so much to show, prove you say you take a Hold off your life, make it right And you have so much to show Prove yourself And through the darkest times We see both sides Them see me arise And them still want fight Though deep inside They see the pain in my eyes The deepest fights Sing God we survive Them penalize And criticize Advertise And tell a bag of lies Them tetting take time Go through time We do things I'm gonna make it right Take a hold off your life Life, make it right and you have so much to show prove you say you take a hold of your life make it right and you have so much to show prove you say yeah how many lonely nights, tears I've cried See if it's nice, I wanna change my life this really nice really nice choose your choice to you better do wow. what what better message can anyone ask for? Take a hold of your life. Nice. That's a title, right? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, and it's got a buzz, right? Yeah, it There's a buzz right a buzz. now for it. Definitely have a good buzz, say. Because the message is good, and everybody wants to take a hold right now. Yeah, yes. yeah because Corona basically take a hold of it. So we have to take our all our life anyway. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? That basically that just with the virus and everything we are talking about in general. Yes. With everything, your life, your kids. You know, because I'm not just an artist, I'm a mother. You're so, a mother, yes. yes. You're a mother of one. Yeah, I've one, my daughter. She's six. Um, yes. Big up yourself, Jaden. Love you, mommy. Love you. Nice. All right, yeah. So you're very serious, actually on, on, on route to to better music, to helping to change exactly. how, what we consume musically, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah As you said, it's on the other side of the song. Yeah. You, know, you, you want to be proud of what you sing. You want to, yeah, exactly. to, to sing positive music. Yeah, definitely. And it, this one is taking a hold of, of us <laughs> fans and, <laughs> and, and the space, yes. Definitely. Sounding good. And, and so you grew up in uh, Maxfield. Yeah, definitely. You know what I mean? Um, in a city community, all kinds of temptations. So how do you navigate? What are you doing to navigate temptations? Um, you know, stay focused, mm -hmm. focus, stay focused and write more songs. You know, stop right, mm -hmm. never yet stop right. Yeah, and music, I like everything for me. Music has been everything for me since. Like, I, even if you ask my classmates from like primary school, them could have said, and can they would have be an artist? Yeah, because every day would I beat the decks and I sing. I was yes. one of those type of person. So music, I, something, but I think it chose me. And I want to almost stop. I try to stop the music. I did try to stop doing music mm -hmm. at one point. It come like it never did a work at one point. And it just, we could do that. So where are some of the places in the world you're getting response from? Um, yeah, um, I, say, I, must, I must say I get mad love from Ghana. Mm. Guyana too as well. I get mad love from London, England, Birmingham. All mm. England my place, literally. Everybody yes. love me in that. Um, some parts in the America, um, mm. ca Canada, same way too. Um, France, I get a whole heap of buzz in France. Like German people too as well. So it, 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 my music kind of cover a wide space of, of people, not just the typical way that I want to hear more international song. So Candy, we're gonna leave the rest for later. When you come again. Yeah, I just wanna say mad love to my production team, mm -hmm. um to Drew Million, all of my friends that was involved in my career like them just always I say Candy never stop with this, J Bass, Apple, Drop Top, um just the whole promotion team, Maxi, Reddy's Road, everyone who is supporting and still supporting Candy Price, Mad Love. I like your spirit. It's positive. Love yours. Yeah, yeah. Very energetic. 
vibrant and, and yeah we're we're gonna wish you well and hope hopefully I that we never you. ever have to ask you the question again why is she not boss <laughs> no that's not but next time you're gonna ask me why oh candy fries get so big the next time we come back on the stage <laughs> absolutely eh? absolutely that's what we we were looking forward to i must say too i'm very very proud to be here because my sister is always like the winner mm -hmm. in the family so i'm like being very proud to be like making them feeling proud of me now so oh, nice. yeah uh, feeling very proud of myself for that oh wow yeah okay my dear Thanks again for coming and sharing with us right here on our stage. All right, thank you for having me. It's my good pleasure. Okay, and the next right here on our stage, why an artist like the Ruption, no boss yet, and later, Lisa Mercedes graces our stage in the flesh, and Gage gets off his chest. Thoughts about dancehall unity, and brings us up to date on his career. All coming up. On stage with Winford Williams. His search for a place in music spans over six years. But when one listens to his music, one wonders why is this artist not among the breakouts in the space? He's reminding us of two recent breakout artists that we profiled right here on our stage. Yaksta and Nation Boss. For like them, this artist is country-based. St. Thomas, to be exact. Right now, right here on our stage, Deruption, sir. Blessed love, welcome, man. welcome, Blessed good to have you. Man. Yeah, man, Blessed love, man. Thanks for having me in a real time. Oh. My pleasure, Bridget. Yeah. Listen, we want to start with you telling us about the journey because I just don't understand why you're not getting more love out there, why we don't know you like we know Nation and, <sighs> and Yaksta and others. All right, first, first and foremost, um, big up to all of the viewers they know presently mm -hmm. and big up my team. And, but in the aspect where, where love is concerned with Nation and Yaksta, um, it's different. God gave everybody a different journey, you know? Yes. So my journey is completely different. Mm -hmm. So everybody get them time and space. So it's not really like the bus me around down. At the end of the day, I still like, grow within myself, within yes. my messages that I bring out. So I'm be careful of the things that I put forward. So in that aspect now, I just focus on what I'm doing now. Mm -hmm. And when God says, I hear time now, I feel my time now when you miss out my time. Okay, we, we weren't, I'm sorry if the impression is given that we're trying to compare artists there, we're not. I got a chance to listen to your EP and I, and I had to just conclude oh. that this artist ought to be out there. We need to hear more from an artist like you. And, uh, and so I'm not comparing you, but you remind me though of them mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. they're country based. Yeah, big up my brother them real time. Yes. So, and them singing music now with substance and that are the type of music we bring across. And if you look on music now, people span now where music is concerned, it's very short. So in other aspect you're putting out music now with substance, it needs time. Yes. Music with substance needs time. Yes. So Timeless. With, yeah, so music with substance now we can just break within the space of, of, of one week. Mm -hmm. So um for instance, even, even the same Yaksta. Before Yaksta, ambition bus, indeed, one month before. But he just put out the visual now and then it bus after. But he, he told me, you know, he's been time. out there for a long time. Yeah, we know Yaksta, because we used to step on road tours together. Right. Yeah, me and he he had to told me when he came to our stage, mm -hmm. right, around um, ambition, mm -hmm. that he had recorded over 300 songs. Yeah, I, I, watch the, I watch the interview as well. Yes. Yeah, but Yaksta, Yaksta is a good artist. Big up Yaksta, big up Nation Boss. Nation. Yeah, so when the time comes to bridging, it comes. Yes. Yeah, so and as you were saying, you're, you're writing 
music that is that could be considered Substance. timeless yeah, substance, substance is always going to be relevant yeah last forever so yes. more when time me pass my children and my children children can continue listening cool. to music so it's like the marley's same yeah so it's like the marley's music me now i want to sing a song with just like a last for a week and the aspect of me doing music now first starting out in music it was all about like the fame and the money and whatever mm -hmm. comes with it but now we're doing music, it change overall. We sing music now for change lives. We don't just sing music, we just sing music sake. And enough people now call me the messenger. Because when I'm, when I'm singing music, it's not like I write it down with pen and paper. I just sing, so the mm. message just flow naturally. Whole heap of soul. Whole heap of soul. And if the song now have no ah, yeah. feeling, me can't sing it. Yeah. And I don't force music. So if, if a producer send me a beat and say the eruption, I want a song on this. If I listen to that rhythm two, three times and it not kick me, I me, me not go force it any at all. So you not go catch me a force to make a song. I have to just wait till the time for that rhythm come, it come. All right, so let's give a taste of what you sound like to the audience. When me start by one, one lock and two, two still come a one, oh my one feel. The title is One One Block. Says it all about this artist. It's right there. Yeah. You remember, Jim? Man, patience. Step, man. Patience. If I never feel patience in a real time, because I could have given up on the journey in a win for it. Mm -hmm. and, and, and this is why I love my team so much, because in the aspect, in the aspect enough time I feel like I give up in a real time, but in the aspect of you know, my team around me, I always support me, and I say, yo, don't stop sing. When I yeah. can sing song, I see, I see people drop down, real time. I see people come in my studio, and, and ask my producer, say, oh, all right, that's a direction vice. I said, direction is supposed to be in my studio right now. And when I came out of the studio, and the man, see me, the man start crying, yeah, I water in front of me, literally. Mm. And I see the man start back, back till he drop on the fence. So I said, geez, I'm on to you. I have a song I released just before one one black now, titled From That Place. Yet to me, I said, big up the producer from, from that place in a real time, star quality. But from that place, very Im impactful and it get a good run for the couple of three months now it put out mm -hmm. and that song that song mean a lot to me and knowing so it mean a lot to other people as well and i tell you it's it's overwhelming the feeling can't explain yes. overall so money couldn't buy that feeling in no time can we take a little piece of it right now of course let's do that let's take a little piece of it same if we take the streets and i time oh god poor is a crime that place Again, that next place, them pray for me. I did my children now. The man, I'm from that place. Them say, full of sins, man, get killed for them things. And we are the definition of art. But children now, art, and win for it. Yeah, the people not go like you, not for like them neither. The place full of greatness, but only few believers. Them say, what well, due to Caesar, you forgive to Caesar. But guess the Caesar not go get it till the day reach for. No, no, I mean, I mean, for be rude. But my girl always eat up in where them can get food. No, I see this naked and no nude. Cause everybody get the same plate, but different food. That place where friends kill friends, dog eat dog. Next place, them pray for we are the man wow. from that place. Yes, I. Yeah, man. You know what I mean? Yeah, man. And that brought tears to this gentleman. Yeah, and, and he, he wasn't the first, because um, this is when we start music serious, because we do mm -hmm. a show in Portland. That was six years ago, and, and I was singing a song um, titled Working. Yeah, I remember working, singing that song, and it, it was very impactful to a Rasta man, a Rasta man dropped down in, a, in a, the event and tell me so every single thing I was singing out of the song was his life I was singing about. Whoa. So at that, at that specific moment, he just had a, had a conflict with him and the woman at the same time. So at the same time now, he come at the show right after the conflict and me I sing about the same thing that just happened. Yes. So it was like, he must say, yo, which part I come from? The Rasta man dropped down right in front of me, right at the stage. I made have to stop and help him I help people lift him up and and he man say you they don't know where you are things so. and I said John We're gonna leave the rest for your return to our stage. Yes sir, you expect man. Because we expect that you will come back here with 
inspirational story yeah, yeah when man. you ascend to the next level brother of course enough respect man big up my team and yeah again elite generation big up big up big up everybody big up the listeners them now big up on stage big up yourself again win for narrative yes, love, i appreciate narrative respect love and love alone yes sir i believe you deserve to get the full attention mm -hmm. of the space yeah and i think if they do give you some love I listen to your music, mm -hmm. your catalog, and what you're about. Yeah. I think they will find you an artist mm -hmm. that deserves the boss. Yeah. And it's not often that I ask my following to do anything. And I'm going to ask them to boss you. <laughs> right now, I tell them, say, all of you, everywhere you are on the planet right now, give this artist a listen. I appreciate please. that, man. I appreciate yeah? that. And tell us how you feel about it. You don't know where to find us. Tell us how you feel about it. I appreciate that, man. You know what I mean? Listen and your, your social media? Mm -hmm. There's all the option music. So you put in the option all right. music, it's there. All right, so there you have him in this segment. The eruption. The eruption. Go look him up. Listen to him. Support him. And stay right here on stage. Still to come. Lisa Mercedes graces our stage in the flesh. And later, Gage gets off. His chest, thoughts about dancehall unity, and brings us up to date on his career. All coming up. When we met her last year via Zoom, she resided in the UK and was not in the least shy about being in a romantic relationship with dancehall world boss, Vice Cartel. As I said, may I leave that that is very deep mm -hmm. and it's not a lot of people going to understand it. She's now in Jamaica and we are just about to chat one on one exclusively with Lisa Mercedes. Lisa, welcome. Oh, I'm going one further. Good to see you home. Thanks for having me. You are fulfilling your promise because you did say that when you come to Jamaica, you'll come on our stage. And well, I haven't been back to Jamaica like maybe five years now. Mm -hmm. So I decided to just come out here and um, record some music and shoot a music video mm -hmm. and also come to come see you. <laughs> yeah, so we can talk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so in social media, persons were saying that you can't come back to Jamaica. Yes, <clears throat> they were saying that. Uh, and you're here now, so, so what was Listen, that all about? People, I just think sometimes people just make up some crazy story, mm -hmm. like for no reason at all. I think sometimes people think they know, I think they, they just know more than me, more than what me know about myself. Yes. Because when I did their interview, like people just come up with this madness, some vlog on YouTube saying, oh, she's running from Jamaica, she can't come back, man, I got to kill her. I'm thinking, what's wrong with these people? Uh, and like a lot of people run with it and don't actually believe it. Okay. I mean, I say people are crazy. We can't come and come and yard anytime we want. So that was after the viral moment. Yes. When you came on moment, stage. When I came on the show, yeah. And confirm rumors. Right. You, you had put something out about a relationship. That yeah. he's your boo. <coughs> Cartel mm -hmm. is your boo. So. Right. And mm -hmm. thing. And that went viral. And then you came on our show. And so the bashing started after that? Yeah, the bashing started straight after that, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. So where's that bashing now? Is that bashing now? I think it gone. You know, so them going to talk for nine days and then them just stop. Yes. What hurt you most in what they say about you? What hurt me most uh -huh. is the bit when I say, I can't come back on my yard and man going to kill me and I run away. I mean, I say, yo, these people are just evil. Mm -hmm. But then when I actually talk to other people, I say, Lisa, I saw the... I saw dance all, some of the dance hall people them stay. Yes. It's like they will just make up stories about you. So I never really take it to art still. Me kind of say, me just kind of just understand now and say, raw. Because to be honest, me there the UK well a year, so I never really kind of, when it come to the hardcore dance hall, I never really know them that much. Mm. So obviously Carter put me out there way where uh, them know about me now, innit? Uh. So, the way them attacked me was crazy, yo. But I wouldn't say it's dance all. I would say it's social media, mm -hmm. generally. Yeah, social media, but again, obviously them are like the hardcore dance all fans because I'm a dance all artist. Mm -hmm. So, they so really they, attacked me wicked, wicked. So they don't accept you? They, they think you're a, an a, a, imposter or something? <laughs> I, I wouldn't say You're imposter. an outsider? <laughs> Yeah, I think them more think like, oh, the foreign girl, they wouldn't like her, Ray. And 
I don't know why them class me as a foreigner, because me a Jamaican. Yes. I don't know too, sometimes I kind of talk a little bit of British thing, like most say in it and that. Mm. But come on now, Winfred, if you live in England for much years. 17 years like, you've like the, been there, Yeah, right? the first time I go to England, you know, I'm going to one shop, you know, I'm going to the shop and say, you can sell me a pants, please. Mm. The woman never really understand what I say. She's like, pants? Like, what are you talking about? She called over one next woman for come, for come. Them couldn't understand what I say. So me living there over the years, my Africana break that my other kind of know if it's because we can't just talk like why well, go on like send maybe me you should have said trousers trousers yes the trousers this is the official english pronunciation but we in jamaica said trousers maybe they don't get that me if i understand them something that lady yes. the lady care one next woman comes she said oh sorry i want trousers yeah. you understand our next scenario again when we go ask a panty this is my first right in the pan um i want two panty come i new in the country you know Mm. And then I said, no, it's knickers. So after all these years, I live in England, I have that little twang there to me sometime. Mm -hmm. But sometimes we use them, I say, I wish I had speaky spoken so far. Mm -hmm. But I don't speak spoken, I speak spoken. Once I live in England over 17 years, you automatically adopt. 17 years in the UK. Who were you before, though, before going to the UK? Lisa. I was just like a shy girl. Like My dad died when I was like 15. Mm -hmm. And then after that, I just moved to the UK. I never grew up with my mother. Yes. Um, my mother dropped me and my father out, so I'm at three months old. Leave me outside in a box, as same tell me. Really? Yes, yeah, so I never really grew up with my mom. That's what I say, like, sometimes people see the glory, but they don't know the story. She said she couldn't really manage with she had about seven kids. And so she tell me, because mm -hmm. when she come to England, I actually ask her, because my next sister invited her over there. And like, I said, I'm going to say her briefly, I'm going to ask her a certain question, and she just said, oh, she couldn't afford we and this, that, that. But like, I'm going to kind of break down come and say, oh, you couldn't afford to look after me, but you don't have your next daughter with you. You know, and up until this day, I'm still hurt. It's like a thing where, I don't know, I just can't get over it. Mm. And I met her when I was 16, but when I meet her, I still have the bond with her. I'm going to spend a couple months with her or whatever, but the band still wasn't there, you understand? So then I leave and then I just come to England and yeah, so listen, I've been through my dad died and so my basically don't grow up with no dad and no mom. And who? me, Winfred are the true definition of a strong black woman. Mm -hmm. And people people don't really know that about me. So who are you in, in the UK? Right, so yeah, things change now. I'm going to the UK now and grow up and you know as an immigrant in you know, the UK. I went through a lot. When I say a lot, the same thing again, people see the glory, they don't know the story. Mm -hmm. When I first got to that country, I've been through so much, it's unbelievable. Just like most immigrants in it. Yes. Some of them go and some got through more things more than, you get me? Mm -hmm. So like, I used to live in a house where like rat, a crawl, mm -hmm. mice. I never know said them something that they're, they're London. Mm -hmm. Meetings in London was a better rose when I first got to London. I'm end up, one of the time I stay with one lady, I'm gonna have to leave, I'm end up, I sleep at people's yard, I end up get pregnant with my, um, my son. I end up all asleep in bed with all four people. Then we get one like a one room at Tower Bridge Road. And I remember this like yesterday, Winford. I get one like a one bed at Tower Bridge Road, I go there, and my sister run up and down, I invite my friend there, she had jumped, I look a white friend, cause she not used to them something there. She had jump up and down from the mice and my feet so shame. You understand? And then at the same time, I have my papers, you know. Mm. So I have to run for me, I have to hide from immigration and like, listen, I start work on a law firm as a legal clerk. Um, then somebody got got informed for me, I have to left, run up and down, end up at work at a strip club. Listen, I've been through the most. So I said the most. Right now I talk to you is like. I'm literally getting emotional, like, it's crazy. Yes. But I'm sure the struggle we Jamaican have got through when we go in our country, and then people see me and I'm thinking like, oh, she have it easy, or she have post like an Instagram picture that a girl like I have, she have wear designer. Like, everything, with them see now, I work hard for that. Mm -hmm. And a farm where I come from, you understand, so. So you're settled and successful? Yeah, man, settled, man. Yes. I'm good to go now. Yeah. That's why that's I'm just happy I live my life because I know I've been through. But you, and it wasn't easy. But so you 
So home is where? Jamaica or? Oh, my yes, sir, yeah. But and both, innit? London and Jamaica. So you're not, you're not give up London no, no time soon? I'm not give up London. Well, I've got my two kids there, so I'm not going to really give it up, give it up. Mm -hmm. But you know, the dance and music, ears are the roots, ears are the ground in it. So, mm -hmm. yes, I'm at home, really, when I come on to the dance hall thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, all right, so let's talk about that and your, your career. So, dance hall is your full focus nowadays? Yes. Plus, I'm an entrepreneur as well. Mm -hmm. What's your business? Um, I've got Lisa Money Cosmetic. It's in the pipeline now. Somebody else have planned everything. Mm -hmm. So that's my um, lipstick line. I'm going to be starting soon. Yeah. Out of the UK? Yeah, definitely. The company registered everything already. OK. Plus, we have G BGC Records, Boss Girl Circle. We have that as well. So I'm going to start signing one and two artists. Not now still, but in the future. All right, so let's talk about music, because your mission here is to yes. record music and mm -hmm. other things. Yes, yeah, so. so basically, I'm going to come here for um, record music. Um, I've done a single with Big Love from Ochi, mm -hmm. and we're going to be shooting that video tomorrow. Mm -hmm. And definitely, I'm going to have a link Red Boom, and yeah, man, so I'm just there for work, though. Yes. So is it a special project you're working on, or, or just? Yeah, I'm just doing a single. Just a single? Yeah. <clears throat> OK, and that? single is, will be out soon? Yeah, definitely. But we have one queued up. What is that? Um, no, I've got a next song when we do with this UK artist called Gigs. Mm -hmm. So I shot that video before I come to Jamaica. So that's going to drop the 9th of July. Then my other song with Shata Wally, Aishana, that's going to drop as well. Mm -hmm. Maybe like a month after. So I'm just trying to be consistent. So like one song can drop after the other. All yeah. right, so let's take... And then the big love song and then, yeah. All right, so let's take this one, right? Right after rhythm, it naturally. Still about the pep. So that's the one you did in the UK? Yes. So what about the cartel collabs that you, you, you're so proud of? Oh, yeah, I've got loads of songs with him. Yeah, I have to be proud of it because I look up to this man for years, you know? Mm -hmm. So, yeah, man. So um, we've got um, the latest song that we did is As Long As Life. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's the latest song. That's the latest one? Mm -hmm. And is there a video for that? Yes. And it's skewed up right now? Yeah, man. Let's go to it. <laughs> Run it. OK, there you have it. As long as life. There is yeah. Lisa. And world boss. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and we'll have Wallet more song too. We have Run Dance Hall, we'll have Badman, we'll have, um, there are so many, I can't remember some of them. <laughs> See? But the people might give me a fight when food, me don't know how I'm do that. <laughs> Why? Because you're getting so much of Carter? Me don't know, you know. I don't know how I go to Jamaica. Eh? I don't know, I feel, all right. Me personally feel say, one, I don't know, we'll probably come out to a rope on them. I don't think I'm to the foreign girl. Yeah? Mm -hmm. And secondly, we probably misunderstood. And then maybe third, maybe that's bad man. Mm. Yeah. And treat me like them own Jamaica and I stop calling me a foreigner. I don't like this foreigner thing, man. Yeah. It's annoying. Well, let's see what happens with it. Yeah. Now that you're, you're calling on them to do so. Have you done that before? Ask them to I'm stop just calling just now. On a leg on my shorts, <laughs> on a leg on my skirt. On the leg of my shoes. <laughs> so, so, are you Come love on Because, and the, the maddest thing is, yeah, yeah. As, as an artist, as a dancehall artist living in London, may I carry the map with me, you know? Like, I'm representing, may I represent for my culture? Yeah. So, I want to you get me support me to the way me support and rep for Uno. Simple. Yeah. Are you going to visit the world boss? Jesus Christ. When for I say this to you? Oh. <laughs> no comment. No comment? No, next. Well, I mean, I mean, it is allowed. I mean, it's, it's legal. So what can you tell us about the status of the relationship, the romantic relationship? Well, with that, no, Winfred, that's going to be a no comment. From the last time, the whole of excitement to go on. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to say no comment to that. Because my personal life right now is like a closed book. Yeah, really? it is. Because of that? Because of what happened around that last time we spoke? Because what? Because of what happened around... Yeah, man, my personal life is a closed book right now. Mm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Well, my dear, 
Whatever it is, it is. <laughs> <laughs> you like, I wonder, whatever it is, it is. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right then. Then we're ready for listening to uh, close book. Uh, the Chocs. BC Festival in Europe. Oh, yes. The festival there. Yes. Uh, you are on it, right? Yeah, big festival. Yeah. Coming up in when? In, in August. In August. Yeah. And you're booked on it. Definitely. Contract signed, done payment, make everything. So I know I did it. And it's, uh, it's, we say BC, but we can't call the we name. We can't call the name. Them out of that city. Right. But big up Team Dam for Wally. Big up yourself. Can you know it's at a festival there? I got mad. Okay. And before I go, I just want to big up my London team. Yes. Um, they've been doing such an amazing job. So big them up. I want to big up Sika Rhymes. I want to big up World Boss. Um, I want to big up my fans. Last but not least, my fans and my supporters. Because if I never for Uno, there wouldn't be no Lisa Mercedes. So that's one big number. May have supporters still, you know? Mm -hmm. But I just want them where, you know? But just tell them, say, yo. What about that? Yo. What do we yeah. do? No, may have supporters there, man. Some of us want big one up. All right. Yeah. Bless up, Lisa. All right, so there you have her in this segment. Lisa Mercedes. And still to come right here on our stage, the dance or gauge. Since his break in 2014, he has been a very consistent contributor to the space in terms of material. But why does his profile continue to be low? The gauge of dancehall is right now, right here on our stage. Gauge, sir. Well, I go and win for the gauge of that song. Yes, man, we're there, man. But That's why, right. why, why? That's why they can't get you up. I have to why you up on the profile, man. It's not low. You know? It's not low? No. <laughs> why? But yeah, man, it's good for the pan stage, man, you know? Yes, you sir. You up, man. We're there. Yeah, yeah. Well, we go back to the profile then. Yeah. Is it your personality or, or what? Because we know you're putting out work. You have a presence. True. But, but what? I will hear what oh, you're not hype like some other artists. No, nah, man, you see, when it's time for hype, Winford, it's time for hype. You see, but no, it's not the time for hype. Well, um, I remember mean, I say, from the lockdown time, I never time for hype. You see, we just did there, put in some work, yes. motivate the people, them right show. Mm -hmm. You see, I make them know what is what. But as soon as the place up, not back, and we are up on the stage, and the girl, them, we say, and the things in a frenzy again. <laughs> <laughs> you see me? So when I time for hype, I time for hype. I okay. just remember the time. Well, it seems like, it seems like the, the time for, for hype is pretty much here. With the re reopening of places in the world, not just Jamaica. You say it the right way, the reopening of the place. <laughs> yes. yes. Mm -hmm. So you're preparing now to go? Well, as I said, we're always preparing. You know, that's one of the things, make. As you say, we a high profile car, we're not always there everywhere. We more put in work, you know, say, while doing the work, that's not the, the interested part. Mm -hmm. The writing of the, the work and vicing, that's not what people want to see, you know? Mm -hmm. They want to see the smokes and the mirrors and the pretty this and pretty that, which we don't really have a time to write you, as you may, so we have time for the work. So that is why I don't really, that's one of the things, too. Mm -hmm. I just work where I put in, you know? So we always have projects, so you don't have to ask if. We have things, things, things to work on. Yeah, we, but yeah. the girls, them, make with them over there. No? Well, that is evident yes, because yeah. we've seen some of your releases out there, even yeah, on man. the trending and, yeah. and these things. Well, that's that true. So, <laughs> so, but it's, it's just that we don't see enough of you, I suppose. Uh, yes, so yeah. How tough would you say the pandemic has been to you? For the time I was locked down for? Yeah. From them time, I'm not doing a stage show in for oh. You get what I say? So, 15 that, months that, about 15 months. All right, months. so well, that chap with a big piece of our food, a big mm -hmm. piece of our earnings. Yeah. Yes, we still do things like dub. We still do a lot of 45s, which is for vice for and mm -hmm. and all of that. You know what I mean? We still get to checks them, them come in. But you know what the bigger part of the food is the show. Is no, it, go around in the live, so. the live Yeah, there. the live part of it, isn't it? Yes. So once we can't get faith, we do all of that. You know a piece of the earnings cut about, as I say, Everybody has got to choose something hard right now. So as an artist, we just have to play our part. So, and so what are some of the takeaways so far from it, from, the, from what happened with the pandemic and, the, and the, the changes in the way you earn money? Well... What will you do differently in the future? 
if anything? Oh, <laughs> well, honestly, for me, me nothing more that do nothing different for the future. Because as I say, me survived the pandemic. I get to me as we are survived it and. It's not like say yo, we never know say one day it a go be a rainy day. Yeah. We just never plan for a flood. Is it me? But yeah. yeah, but we know say a rainy day always ever come. So we always and I think everybody if you always pray that way that too. Mm -hmm. Like not just say yo, yo, when the next pandemic come, we want to make sure we have this and that. Always try to put on a look at this and look at that. Yes. Uh, yeah, I gonna need it one day, is it me? So I want to prepare no other way different. Probably stack up some more, but we live. Where we really want to go, I want to hear that. Artists are becoming more aware of timelessness Meaning? in their catalog, so that when they, when there is a, a slope yeah. or a stopping of yeah. the flow of, for example, physical appearances at shows, true, true. you're still earning a, a living and some some money are trickling from what? from publishing and from oh. performance royalties. And yeah, as I said, we get royalty checks. Yes. That was one of the things that helped me throughout the pandemic. But is it enough? Could you, is there anything you can do to make sure that in the future more of that are running? Put in more work. Yes. As because I said, everything no must it, but everything add up at the end of the day. Ah. So add that to the as you mean. Good argument, good argument, cool, Reggie. Man. <laughs> All right, so, so we have a song queued up. True, one of the true. two then we have. Yes, I maintain <laughs> yes, the, your business and your brand. <laughs> so make we go to it all right now. Right, all right. And if you know the roads you walk, you don't go panic. It's some lonely days and rainy nights filled with tragic. Roads is the title of, of that one from The Gage. <laughs> wow. But that sounds like a song that fits the time we're living in. Well, I don't mean I try to show you. As you ask me, the, the first question you ask me, yes. I say, when well, I time for hype, I time for hype. Like, my type of song that I boss me, I don't expect people for the other side now I go through them hardship and I listen to them songs there. Mm. You know what I mean? So, Winford, I always tell you this. I am an artist. I <laughs> always tell you this, brother. Yes. You see me? I go, me, me go with the times. Mm -hmm. It can't be Christmas and I sing about summer. Like, it we are. It's not much to me. Mm -hmm. You see me? So, when I saw go on, I see people need upliftment now. You get to me and say, girl, no need no dung in a dung in a now. <laughs> you see me, I always need the butt. You see me, but. <laughs> you get to me and try to say to you, a time for motivate the people, yes, uplift the thing. And as I say, as an artist, play my part throughout the pandemic. So if I saw me can do it, so me can do it. You see me? It appears that there, there's been some movement towards unity in dancehall. Am I correct in my observation? Yeah, well. Yeah, there appears to be some unity, but the unity are for them. It's not for dancehall. You get to me and say, if you understand dancehall in a Winford, mm. dancehall are not our friend. You see me and say, I know, I know. But me not say, you yeah, don't want to help myself, but understand this, brother. Dancehall always want the world things we are going, the magic. The hype moments, the niceness. You get to me and say, like, in a heat time moment, we don't know if you be friend, we don't know how to be friend, you know. Like, we don't know, somehow we don't want to be friend in time, nothing is going on, and we feel like, say, oh, this is going to make everybody good. And nobody not really care about that after a long while. That's just the truth. So, mm -hmm. somehow we don't want to be friend, we don't be friend, we don't business. It might sound weird when I say it. You're right, man, them if you be friend, still are going like them, no want to be friend. You see me like, who lead the game a full time, they done the full niche and just be friends. Right. And just make some money like, you know, kill enough to make some money. And Are you saying that they, they, they don't want, it's better to be unfriendly? No, I mean, I say better to be unfriendly in a Winford. I mean, I say, when a time, like, in the heat of the moment, brother, when time everybody make the millions, when it's enough to be friends and make that two million, mm -hmm. you, know, you know, still do you know, do one. Who no not want to do that? Everybody have them own ego and everybody have do them own thing, which is we are not wrong with that. Everybody have them own man, but then after a while now in time, one and one make 200,000, each and make two, two and one start make 200,000. Now that the time we're not ready for build friendship now. And like when you not do them thing, you can't just link off a year and say, yo, no good and what have you, but don't put it in a dancer like say, yo, this is some big wow thing. Look who and who finally link. We don't care. That are the truth, like Winford. Me, I know when I am on them, I pretend like, say, yo, I can't believe, say, XYZ and XYZ, the unity is there. But down the unity, no make no sense again. Mm -hmm. That are truth, you want to hate me, you hate me. It's, but 
So you're not moved by what you see happening? No, brother. Moved by what, brother? Like, the real man, them know themselves. Mm -hmm. Winford. You know what I say? Dance all right now. Artists, they are Jamaica right now. Where if it two of them see a Sabumar, three of them see a Sabumar, I could do a collaboration. I bet by a man in the real million views, like probably five million views or more. Like, me not ask, me not tell about, hey, man, you ego big, brother. Because mm. I'm not talking about views we are going to buy. I yeah. say, like, that is dance hall, brother. Like, whoa, we, bro. Who know a lead? Whoa, we. Show with mm -hmm. niceness. Make unexpected things we don't expect happen. That is dance hall, brother. Certain things we don't know, we expect you over and over, brother. Like, it's, it just happens, so. Yeah, well, give them a chance. Eh? They start. There's some things that go on, so let's see. Yeah, my question, that's all I can say about. Well, that's all we want you to say right now, then. Eh? <laughs> that is good enough for me. Yeah, well, all right, then. Well, Give it a chance, me man. Tell you, say. you see me? So, what about an eye for an eye with Devin the doctor? Well, that's a great song, you know. Um, first of all, that was Devin's song, you know. Yeah. Devin write the song and sing the song to me and ask me if I want the verse, if I want a verse, and I tell him, yeah, because the song so nice, the idea was genius. Yes. As in, so I just feel like, yes, why not? But wouldn't you consider that unity? Me and Devin never have no problem. Okay. We never have nothing. Okay. We never come create no small, small cameras for the people. <laughs> we look like, see, we no problem. We go. But that one not count. No, brother, that no count. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And they've been good long time, brother. Yeah, yeah. You see me? So, how is it doing though, this song? It, you know, this yeah. song I do good, like, it I do real good, you know? Mm -hmm. It I do what it do, like, as I said, this song is genius. Yeah. A theme, idea, put it together, write my verse and do what I do, but it is genius. And as I said, Winford, that is dance, all that is music. Try create magic, brother. Not because everybody can talk and everybody can DJ, means everybody a DJ, brother. Because I say, you know, brother, like, we can't treat dance all like, say, yo, you got sorry for everybody and sorry for this and sorry for that because you want you to come from around this, man. If you're not bad, you're just not bad, brother. You don't make no sense, you just don't make no sense, brother. Well, you don't make no sense, you just don't make no sense. That is dance all. And until you start treating dance all, so everybody always go get down and wonder, yo, what's going on in my music? Mm -hmm. some, ma oh, some man go come and say, oh, some man too hype, some man go come and say, some man not too hype. I see him thing, nothing has changed. You don't have to treat dance all like what it is, brother. When you can't do and just let in every and anything and then complain about yo, this and that and that and this. No, brother. <laughs> Treat it like what it is. You see me? Now for them come sit down right by us about when you ask them, so what you come to do? Me come for see of dance hall. Come for see of what, brother? I care me did a wash before this, brother. How me have all me for see of dance hall? <laughs> a dance hall save me, brother. I don't me I tell you, and after me left dance hall, it's still a go good. Yeah. After enough for we left, it's still a good, brother. So talk the truth like what it is, brother, and stop making it look like dance hall now. You know, can't make money, brother, and do the right thing. Mm -hmm. Brother, come on, man. We share that genre of music here, artists get up more. Oh, me no need dance hall, and I no need no music, me rich, you mad? You ever hear one hip hop artist say that? And we know say them no need it. Mm -hmm. We know Jay Z don't need to sing an next song. You ever hear him say them no need it? That's cool, my brother. Treat dance hall like what it is. If you no grow on it, it'll grow on you, back. Just like that. All right, Gage, we heard yeah. you, sir. <laughs> yeah. well, anyway, that's thank you for your your thoughts. Opinion. <laughs> that's just my opinion. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. We thank you for it. True. And uh, as usual, we always welcome you to our state, sir. Come yeah, on, thank you very much. You're a know. straight shooter, whether we like it or not. Yeah, I just saw me feel. Yeah, you feel, feel that, sir. Yeah, man, I just saw me feel. Yes, sir. And you don't no. take offense to us, No, I me don't no, feel no way. Like, I don't think nobody if you feel no way about me. I don't no come up as I come this, nobody. Mm -hmm. Just I tell them, like, if you don't know, want to complain about dance hall, brother, make platform for dance hall. As you me like, most of them, man, when I see with them billions again to brother, like, you don't know, have a billion dollars, a billion of dollars. We as you, to both from the ghetto, to be like some of you. Know. As you me, some of you have talent and a reach and no do they do. I know what no one come do with it, no one come turn up in a studio with me and give you one reading for vice. You stupid fam. Fam, we want to be like you. Do something mm -hmm. bigger than that. Build something like YouTube. If you not cost about dance hall, the material for dance hall, how about build your own platform then? Try build a platform. You can do it, you know. You don't want to build no Spotify, you don't want to build no YouTube, you don't want to build nothing, but you don't cost people to take away music. 
That's joke thing, bro. That make it look like you know, just want some of my to say, yeah, man, we in our studio and we are doing the thing. No, bro, that mediocre to some of our farm. Uno a million year, brother. Mm -hmm. Not for we as you, we start to be like our brother. So, no, no, I feel better, dog. I don't want to feel away, no feel away. I just saw me see it. I don't know what I'm I'm ready to know, but I just think we can do better. Mm -hmm. You see, I cannot complain. Even the government to say, I want to come be part of the dance. All the dance I'm going to keep. Brother, what about you make one, one Spotify, one YouTube, something, brother, one audio, man. dance all deserve something. Put it on a platform before you can cuss about it and say, Ishi and the old lady are thief. You don't put it on a platform so you can go anywhere, brother. Simple. I don't know yet for them things, I'm going to just take what I say and just work on something, brother. That's all I say. All right, so there you have him. The gauge engaging all of us. <laughs> and I hope you too. All right, and that's our show for this week. But we have on behalf of all of us, thanking you for joining us. Do join us again next week for more on stage. Thanks for watching our video. Please click subscribe and be on our stage anywhere, anytime, always.